Welcome back to Desktop Dungeons. Okay, today I'm going to be trying again, once again, at the Thief Silver Challenge. Now, I've tried this one several times and failed, so hopefully today will be a better day. Uh, we're going to go with Silver Challenge. Yes, please. And I believe we don't even get to choose anything as a result of this. Yes, we are a human and a thief. We don't get any potions. We don't get anything. All preparations are off. But I've done this several times and failed each time. I'm hoping my play has improved a little bit and I'll be able to get this one this time. I know that it's helped out my ability to choose out how many tiles I need when I explore quite a bit, but it's been a while since I've done this as well, so I don't exactly remember how everything goes. I do remember it's uh, very few level 2 enemies here. So, what's this right next to me that I can kill? A let me see. Extremely useful? Yes, it is. Let's pick it up, and we are going to use it several times. Now, we're going to be heading this way to this level 2 enemy. Level 2s are kind of all about, but we need to find some specific things. Uh, for instance, these guys so that we can wait what ne things next to them. Uh, yes, that's our final enemy up there, and he will be annoying, I'm sure, in the future. So, we're going to continue Let Me See. Until we can actually get near an enemy. Actually, that guy might be a prime target. So we're going to go up here, wait what, and switch places with him. Very nice. There's our level two. Uh, can we kill him yet? Not really. But um, hopefully after we grab some power-ups that might be around us. Pick this up. Grab this mana boost. Very nice. Grab that. A little bit of treasure. We are basically looking for attack boosts right now, and we shouldn't have uh, we shouldn't have actually gone ahead with the teleportation over here, but uh, whatever will be will be, I suppose. Uh, we should be using wait what pretty frequently, I think, just because we are exploring so much. So we'll switch places with guy, for instance, to give us access to this potion. Yes, please, and cast a few more let me sees eventually it has to show up eventually we have to uh, I'm switch places with someone here perhaps this level four uh, eventually we have to find that um, other attack booster which we need rather desperately actually so um, it's not about right now we're going to continue looking oh there it is we have to get over there somehow so perhaps we can just travel straight down uh, there's going to be things in our way, of course. We'll be wait wetting those things. So, heading down. Yes, we're going to be wait wetting many a thing. Where is a good location to put somebody? Here, I suppose. So, wait what you. And what's this? Uh, level 9 chest. Here is a level 7 chest. So, don't want to mess with that too much. There's another level 9 enemy, just to be a little annoying. Um, where to put him? Certainly not right here. It seems like a good enough spot. Switch places. And we grab a little bit of extra health and a little bit more attack. Will we be able to take on a level 2 with just that? Um, I don't know. I, I don't believe so, actually. This is the level 5 chest. It's useful. Uh, grab that gold, it's not doing anything for us, but we're grabbing it anyway. Hmm. So how exactly can we face this level 2? I believe we're going to end up using a potion, if I remember correctly, to fight the level 2s. Uh, I know we hit him once, and then we can wait what him, and that's a second hit. Let, let's just try it without a potion first. So we're going to hit him once. No, he does more damage than us. We basically need a potion. I don't know exactly how much potion heals right now, but uh, we'll see. Alright, hit once, and will the potion take us above 8? No, it won't. That's a poor thing, actually, because I don't have... Oh, I do. Uh, I need to heal exactly 3, actually. Hmm. Should be easy enough. Is it 3 to get above 8? No, 2. So I'll need to do this. Heal exactly two tiles, one and two, which gives us another hit. Oh, right, Thief has... I'm just going to restart at this point. I've messed up. 
Too badly, I think. Um, this is not working out. I'm going to switch places with someone. Just so that I don't waste this exploration right here. I need to find maybe... I don't know what I need to find. I need to find more than I have found. I don't remember how to progress in this one. It's been a while. So I'm going to do this and switch places with this guy. Uh, are there more places I should be going here? Um, well, the answer to that question is obviously yes, but still. It has, forgive me a little bit, it's been a while since I've tried this, and I don't remember the trick to it. Uh, I remember there was a way to get these, uh, these level twos beaten. But with just the, let me see, I don't know how it's done. Alright, there's another attack booster, so we're going to want to head that way, I suppose. Uh, we can't though because we're idiots. Let's go here where we'll actually be able to get around this dude. Very nice. And head this way. Uh oh. Uh, are we completely blocked off? Pretty much. We'll use Let Me See a bit. Maybe it'll give us a good spot where we can teleport in over there. I was hoping it would show us this guy. Uh, but if it won't, where is a good spot for us to be that won't block us off? Since this area is already blocked off by this guy, it won't be an issue to switch places with this number five. Get a little bit more health. Is that enough to kill this guy? Four health after one hit. Uh, the initial hit does a lot extra damage, is the thing. All right, we've got eight anyway. Um, here's the other spot. I suppose we can just dump someone. There we go. This is a bit tough. A little bit tough. All right, pick that up. And tell me I can get up there. Please tell me I can get up there. I can't get up there, can I? Nope. Not at all. Alright, fair enough. Let's let me see a bit. Oh man, I might just have to restart this one. Alright, switch places with this guy. And grab this attack booster instead. Health potion. Attack boost. The mana boost, also important, I suppose. But, uh... Yeah, this is, this is being difficult. Uh, lots of exploration. Haven't killed anything yet. These chests are out of my reach. I'm going to switch places with this guy, which will allow complete exploration of this area. Let's look at him. Uh, still says three hits. I still think I will need a wait what to do it. Um, yeah, my, my damage is still only six. It's not like it's gone up. Uh, I think, yeah, my, my bonus is 30%. My damage is only 6. Hmm. This is a bit of a problem. I need to find more stuff. And I can't get past out over there. I want to use Let Me See a bit more. I can go down that way, I suppose. Won't help. Show me something good. There we go. That level 2 is perfect. I can switch places with him right here. Bang. Oh, and there's a level 3 that I can also switch with. I'll just switch with this level 8, I suppose. Alright, go away, Mr. Level 8. You! Is it possible to kill you? I don't think so. I think I'm in deep, deep trouble, my friends. Uh, lots of exploration wasted. This is probably already lost. Uh, in all actuality here. Alright, there's no real need to explore anymore. Either we can kill level 2 or we can't. Um, how to do this is a bit of a puzzle. I'm going to hit him once. Will my health potion do it? Yes, I can do this with one health potion. And I will... Wait, what him? Oh, 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 not yet. I'll hit him again, because I can. Now I get the wait, what. And that allows me to level up. Win. Okay, level two me is terrified at the amount of exploration we've wasted. But I see a level three um, up here. Not in the best of places for me to get to him. But I don't really have much choice. Oh, there's one right here as well. Very good. I will be able to kill him straight up. So hit. Wait, what? Very easy kill. Nice. Nice, nice. All right. I'm going to explore a bit, get the uh, wait what ability going. Um, actually, I want a bit more than that so that I can cast it 
twice with the extra exploration I'll be getting. Uh, I guess that requires me to go down here. Mana potion, very nice. All right, I'll switch places with this level three up here. Uh oh, let's use let me see. Gain that one extra MP. Uh, and I will switch places with Mr. Level 6, who's kind of my whipping boy for that. Alright, we need 8 mana, so let's grab it. Just need 2 more exploration. Very nice. One hit, one switcheroo, and one kill. Very good. Win. Okay. I'm level 3. Can I take on any of these chests? Death. Uh, win. Yes. There's probably something valuable. That's an I'm a wall. Now, I was doing the wrong thing with these Ima Walls before. I should Ima Wall level 9s, because I'm not going to be killing most of those guys anyway. So let's go right here, pick it up, and I'll be Ima Walling things before I kill them from now on. Death, death, death. Alright, all these chests are, are quite the death. So, at level 3, I'll probably be fighting level 4s. Yes, I can kill level 4s. Easy, easy. Let's do one hit, and a switch just like that and that's a dead level four kind of made me happy on the inside where is another level four there's one right there I need to be above 21 health to fight him uh, it's 10 that's not at all 21 and that's 16 19 22 very nice so I can take a nice swing at this level four and wait what for the win and the level up very, very good. I should have probably I'm a wall level 9 before that. My bad. Now level 5s are my target. Um, and I can take this chest, so I will. Uh, End his wall. End his wall is excellent. That's a very important chest because I should maybe go after level 6s with that. Uh, yes, I can't right now. They do 39 damage. But if I can get where I can do 3 hits on them, this is doable. Alright, so, let's grab up the Ender's Wall, and more importantly, let's use the Ender's Wall in locations where it will be helpful, like right here. Uh, kind of open up exploration a bit. Actually, right here is probably best. Nope, that's the wrong button. Ender's Wall is what? E. So let's use that E, and bust open a wall right there. Can I do any of this level 9, and that's level seven so nope not worthy at all all right let's get one more e going um a good place would probably be right here uh, a little oh oh there we go end his wall that and explore over here why not i need to get to full health for sure um another end his wall will be useful probably a good location for it would be hmm anywhere blocked off Let's uh, let's do this. Very nice. Okay. So let's get back to full mana before I try this fight because it's going to be a difficult fight, I think. Yep. And I need to be at least above eight. So can I get two hits off on you? Uh, just one. Uh, I don't know if this is possible, but I, I'm trying it. Let's do this, and that's a wait what end and I'm a wall. I, and in his, in his wall, but I should use I'm a wall before I try this. On, say, this level 9. Not that level 9, this level 9, because it gives me some experience by doing it. Please? Oh, he's this, that's the boss. Can't can't do that on the boss. How about this guy? Yep, give, my, give me my one experience point, please. Alright, so, get back up to 13. Very important. Uh, a place where I can do that would be nice. Right there, that works. Okay. So I can hit him. Oh, I can hit him three times now. Uh, let's hope this works. One, two, and wait what? Safe enough for the win. Very good. That was that was actually pretty pretty amazing. I could just there are a lot of ways I could get this now. Um, should I go after level six again? Or go after a level 5, which would cost far less exploration. How much health do I need to take on a level 5? Just 30. Um, and it would level me up to do so as well. 
That might be my best plan. I've already wasted so much exploration. Let's go here, which is 29, and there's my 33. I could kill this level 5 without too much trouble. Actually, it takes an extra hit, doesn't it? Hmm. So I should end his wall something first anyway. I may as well go after another level 6. So let's go right here. Uh, and get too full. Um, wow, why am I exploring without Indus walling someone first? Uh, who am I not going to kill? Probably that guy. So I'm a wall. You. Very nice. Um, and I'll do the same thing, I suppose. It requires all the Indus walls, I believe, to be able to do this. So Indus wall here. Move forward, end his wall again. Uh, does it require six? It does. All right, we'll grab one there. And there we go. And with one more end his wall, I should be able to tank a hit. So grab right there and right there. Very nice. Uh, where should I go here? I'm going to go here to grab that. Actually, I should go here to grab this extra exploration right here. Very good. I've got three, but I've got my 60%. Can I take three hits? I can, which is perfect. I just need to get above eight mana. Uh, there's three of those eight. And, ooh. See, this is my problem. Okay, there we go. There's two more. That's exactly what I need. Two hits. One and two. And a switcheroo. And one dead dude. And I'm most of the way through level 5 already. So I should probably focus on level 6s again. Or lower level guys or popcorn to get up to level 6. Because things are going badly actually. Things are going very badly indeed. I, have I used a potion besides that initial one? I don't think so. Huh. Alright. I can go into this chest. Can I go into this chest? No, because I can't wait what it and it has first strike. So I can't really go into that chest. Um, let's go into this one and see what's there. A Pendant of Health. Well, I'm not going to be using Lemmy C anymore, so that Pendant of Health might be valuable. Let's get rid of Lemmy C. Perfect. Gives me that extra damage I might be needing right now. And pick up the Pendant of Health. And explore a little bit to get back to full. What is this? This is a level 1 chest with get in there in it. Get in there means I should get rid of wait what, I suppose. Because I'm not using it to move things around anymore. And I, you know, that gives me some extra damage. Pick that up. I should pick this up. And how else can I go to full health? Right there. Okay, I'm at 80. Who are my targets? Um, level 6s might be good targets considering that I can just murder them without too much trouble. Um, yes, I could kill this guy with a single I'm a wall. And end his wall. Um, yes, that's what I will do. I will end his wall here just so I can get to him. I don't think there are any other level 6s. I'm looking around real quick. Oh, there is. There, there is another available level 6, so I don't have to do that. Which is good, because what I can do instead is I'm a wall, a level 9, even though I haven't managed to slow him. Uh, it's okay, he's walled off now, no longer a problem, and then just kill this dude to level up. And win. I'm level 6. How soon can I start fighting you? I could start fighting you right now. Um, is that the best plan? Maybe, maybe not. Probably not. Definitely not. I should level up once first and then get things kind of set up so I can level again maybe. I don't know. I can open this chest. It's the last chest. What's in it? Burned her as. Extremely valuable. In I'm a wall might want to go away when I pick that up. But I'm going to be killing level 7s next. So I'm going to go right here and I'm going to level up somehow, some way pick this up. Um, how am I going to get around here? Let's go this way then. And just a little bit more. There we go. I'm at full health. 
I'm level six. Should I go for a level seven or a level eight? That's a good question. Level eight's gonna be out of trouble. Level seven, much less so. In fact, with that burned as it would be quite easy. If I convert something, it'll be very easy. So maybe I wanna use I'm a wall one last time. Uh, can I just convert this journal, actually? It doesn't give me anything, though. Uh, no reason not to get rid of it. Free up space, I can pick up Burnder as. Pick it up. Uh, yes, I can kill this level 7 now without any further ado. Um, who do I want to I'm a wall? I want to I'm a wall this guy to make this legitimate, I suppose is the word. Hit this guy, fireball this guy, and then get into this guy. So hit. Fireball and get in there. All very valuable ideas. Okay. Another level seven would be nice, but I will have to. Hmm. I need just a little bit more health to do it. I, I take one hit on the way, but I need full mana to do it, so that's kind of a problem. Maybe I should just work on a cheaper level up. Like this guy, for instance. He'd, he would easily support my level up cause and win. Uh, another level 5 I can't go on against, but uh, let's see here. A level 3 would put me up at 23. A level 2 would help out. Hmm. Level 4 down there. I can beat level 4s. Let's do that. Puts me at 24. Puts me at 27. I don't want to be at 27. I don't want to explore anything is the problem. Let's see here. I don't want to use any extra resources. 26. Uh, if I had one more little experience point, that would work. If I kill this guy, I explore two. And I don't want to do that. Because I need those two. I'll be, let's be honest. Uh, I can't take a hit from you, though. Which is a real problem. Alright, I'm going to have to stop being too picky about my exploration then. I will kill you. And you which puts me up at 28 and if I level here I can go after a level 8 at level 7 pretty easily I can probably take on the level 8's uh, and between level 8 and level 9 I'll be wanting to fight my boss or level 7 and level 8 I'll be wanting to fight the boss should I find a way to do it now I don't know it might be a terrible idea anyway I'm gonna win this fight and be level 7 and see what's going on fighting the level 8s. Uh, a tiny little bit more is what I need. No, I don't. I can fight the level 8 straight up, no problem. Uh, an I'm a wall will help that out. Who do we want to I'm a wall? Probably this guy right here. Oh wow, I didn't notice these guys and they would have actually given me that one experience I was talking about a second ago. I'm an idiot. So, I'm a wall. Bang. Alright, so I've got the extra experience now and it's less useful. Yay for me. And this level 8 is a target, but it's not the best target. This level 8 is a better target. Let's see, I can hit you, fireball you, and get in there for the win. I have enough mana to do it, and I'm going to do it. So hit, fireball, get in there, victory. Very, very nice. Um, one more I'm a wall is all I need, I think. Uh, and then I can convert I'm a wall. Uh, I might not get that I'm a wall, but it will make me happy if I do. Let's see how much experience I can get here. Um, let's go down this way. Yeah, I, I don't think I'm going to get that I'm a wall. It's unfortunate. Let's just go ahead and convert it. Uh, which gives me my extra attack and such. So I can. It's still exactly the same killing this guy. Uh, and it still doesn't quite level me up either, but I can kill level fives, so it's not an issue. Let's hit you. Uh, did dodge just happen there? That's pretty crazy. Um, then I will fireball you and get in there. Or actually just, oh, it's too late now, so I'll hit you. Uh, I could have used that extra mana. But whatevers, let's look at our situation. We don't really have much more exploration just right here. We are level 7 and it's time to start fighting my boss. 
totally time to start fighting this boss. He's going to take a lot of hits, but uh, that, that's natural. All right, you don't injure me, so you should just die, and you will level me up. Don't want to level up yet. I want to probably try and kill this dude. Now I can get one hit off on him and a fireball while casting get in there now. Um, that seems appropriate. So, uh, one hit, one fireball, and a get in there. Brings me down to just one health and a 10% dodge chance. At that point, I want to level. Very nice. I'm level 8. And let's look at this boss like something we might actually be able to kill, maybe. Maybe. I don't know. This is a this is a kind of a toss in the air, actually. But I'm hoping. We're going to hit him. This is quite a few hits we have to get off on him. Uh, a fireball or two will be quite effective here. Extra hits would be more effective than a fireball or two, wouldn't they? Um, we'd get in there. Do we want to get rid of Burnderaz? Because end his wall costs the same. How much damage does this guy do? 75. Two end his walls would get me an extra hit. Two fireballs do 64. Eh, it's the same. Alright, end his wall. No. Fireballs. We're going to use the fireballs. So fireball. Fireball. Oh, he's burning. It's so sad. I'm not really that sad. And we'll use mana potions first. It's probably appropriate. Uh, seems like a good option, actually, to use mana potions first. We just have to get above 75 health. And every time we yeah. do this, we get a nice mana potion out of it. So we can use two mana potions for two more fireballs, but mainly just another hit. Two fireballs is fine. And one more. Yes, yes. I'm thinking this might be possible right now. Don't get my hopes up too high. Let's, uh, let's use this up. We'll throw out another fireball before we use the last one. And there we go. That's one more hit. It's safe. And a fireball. Oh my goodness. I just won that. Not only did I just win that, I won it with potions to spare. I've been having so much trouble on this thing. I lost it so many times. But I won with potions to spare, and that makes me just so happy. Balanced dagger. Plus three experience on same level kills. That's crazy, actually. Finely tuned blade, tweaked to perfection, grants three bonus experience whenever you kill a same level XP valuable enemy. That is absolutely crazy. I'm going to pick that up. Yes, please. Uh, and retire. That is an awesome, awesome item. Uh, I can think of so many ways to use that. All right. I mean, you're so often forced to kill things your level, or now I guess I would just want to because it's better than a one level higher kill. Let's exit. Plus three on same level kills. Interesting choice. All right. I need to think about that. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to take that with me. That does, in fact, make it better than one level higher kills. Quest complete, the Metal Age. You lay claim to the charming little blade that is the guard that the guard captain kept in his belt. It's a fine weapon indeed, but you don't have much time to admire it. The alarm has sounded, and you need to enter to either get out or go underground. Reward, balanced dagger. Fair enough. Can we just prep this right away? We can. Ooh, I'm taking this with me next. But what do I get rid of? I like this fire heart. I really haven't used it yet. Uh, especially if I want to go on a... I don't know. This thing could get me extra hits on things. Uh, Battle Mage Ring, I haven't used enough. Crystal Ball, I don't know. I'm going to get rid of Hero's Helm, as sad as that is. Yes, for the Balanced Dagger, though. And the Balanced Dagger just seems so good. This plus three experience on same level kills. All right, that can change a lot. All right. So, thanks for watching, guys. Uh, this has been, you know, a an exciting thing for me because I finally beat my Section Silver Challenge. I've been having so much trouble with them. Uh, it's good to beat one. So, thanks for watching, and... Uh